you're all well so today i'm going to be doing a full face of shine makeup shine is one of my favorite brands i love buying clothes and jewelry and everything from them they do really nice stuff for really reasonable prices um and i just wanted to show you that you can get a full face of makeup um for less than um over 100 pounds which is what you probably pay if you makeup from any other high street brand like L'Oreal, Maybelline etc because everything's at least five to eleven pounds each and it all adds up if you're doing a whole face so make sure you keep watching to see the products i use and how it looks at the end so the first thing we'll be using is this she glam triple threat correcting primer this looks very much like a stiller primer with the three different shades which color correct um, and blemishes and things like that so as you can see if you've ever tried that you know it looks very similar so i'm going to see if it does conceal any dark circles and stuff say he's really concealed anything to be honest but it does feel nice uh, and comfortable on my skin this one feels really smooth and ready for foundation is the foundation i'm using this is she glam skin infinite hydration foundation and it's in the shade there color shade match for me um for my sort of pale but not overly powerful skin it does dry quite quickly um so if you do need any sort of patches unblended then it might be a little bit hard to get off and you'd have to do it again apply it reapply it this is the she glam concealer this is in salad it doesn't have a particular name it's just one of the concealers i got from the app <laughs> Eyeshadow from Shine, I thought it was really pretty. So I'm going to be using this shade first. I'm doing the yellow eye with the shade here. On quite nicely together they don't require a huge amount of blending which is good to got powder so this is she glam velvet veal oil control powder comes in this nice little pouch i'm just breaking it <laughs> let's have a look no it's fine so that's how it looks inside so it's quite a pale shade this is in nude pink <laughs> quite a bit if you use a powder brush like me and if you would prefer to use the little sponge that came with it there's also a mirror on here which is can't be concealed so you've got a mirror so you can apply it on the go which i'll be using is this little pot of joy she glam cheeky color jam in afternoon peach this is what it looks like now a little goes a very long way with this um, so do not apply too much it's, um, it's quite hard to get out if you apply too much um, you just look like you're very very flushed it does have quite a nice smell to it as well it smells a bit like strawberry jam I think um, I've had my fingers as the warmth of my fingers helps to, to melt the brush into the skin Eyeliner I will be using is this, this She Glam um, Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. The box didn't come like that, but the packaging made it very hard to get out. So I have to squish it. That's what it looks like. Nice gold packaging. And uh, I do love a lovely felt tip liner. Very easy to apply with. be 
use it in this mascara it's the all-in-one volume and length mascara so there was quite a few high rated ones on there but a few had like two steps etc which is nice two steps as well um so I would have preferred one is it just two different oh no it's not two steps it's it's two different types of mascara so you can go for some more volume or you can go for this is the curls curly eyelashes so i think i'm going to be going for more volume today Apply another layer. I quite like the effect, my lashes are looked well defined and they feel really lifted as well, which is really good, especially considering I'm wearing eyeliner and I often really can mention this how good mascara is. So, this is actually a pretty good mascara. I'll be using She Glam's highlighter. This is Tea Cake, it's Glow Bloom Liquid Highlighter. And finally, I will be finishing off with She Glam. This is in Topaz and this is in one of their mini liquid lipstick sets. So the cost of all the shine makeup would be £38.83p whereas if you did the equivalent for Maybelline that would be £94.91 so it's a saving of around about £54 over £54 I think that's pretty decent If there's anything you'd like me to try let me know in the comments Try to come up with new videos as much as possible So if you're new, just popping by please hit the subscribe button do let me know what you think of my look, whether you've tried shine makeup and if you're a fan and do comment and let me know what you thought of the video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.